Hello there, so today I will be talking about my favorite citrus notes in fragrances. As there are a lot, I will be talking about a few that um, I actually enjoy wearing and these are um, grapefruit, lemon, lime, and oranges. So first is Yellow Diamond by Versace. So this one is very citrusy. Just by the opening, you can tell right away. But it's also very feminine because most citrus um, fragrances, I find them quite more unisex. Sometimes they even lean more on um, the masculine side. But this one is citrusy, yet still very feminine and elegant smelling. So I could imagine this more during the summer days in your summer dress instead of those white t-shirt and jeans kind of vibe which most um, citrus scent um, is giving me. As I've mentioned, they are more like casual and more um, unisex. Um, reminds me of men's cologne, but this one is more feminine. Um, great for um, summer days, even summer night, as this is more of like a citrus floral scent. This dries down into floral powdery scent. For some reason, there is something comforting in this scent as well, which is unusual for a citrus scent, as usually they are quite sharp, quite um, cooling, but this one is different. This is not sharp at all, which I like. And as I mentioned, this is a little bit warm and comforting as well. Feminine, if you are into those. If you don't like unisex um, fragrances, then if you like citrus but you don't want unisex um, fragrances or scent, then you might like to consider yellow diamond. So next is Chanel Chance Autondra. So you might think this one is more floral or this one, um, this is the least that you would think of when you say citrus. But to me, um, the most noticeable um, notes that I could remember in this one is grapefruit, and grapefruit is citrus. So when you say grapefruit, Chanel Chance Autondra is always on my list. So this one is another very feminine fragrance, great for spring and summer as well, more on summer dress kind of vibe too. Although I can hear some people would say this is masculine, but I don't know, I don't... Um, I see this one is more feminine, maybe because there is some muskiness in this one in the dry down, but to me this is more feminine i don't think of this one being masculine but to each its own but to me this is more <laughs> very feminine very light um very inoffensive kind of scent so to me chanel chance otondra is um very simple casual scent different from the usual chanel that um we are used to but i do like this one it's casual but i won't say it's cheap smelling to me it's classy it's casual it smells like somebody that is well put together. Like the type that even if you wear just a white t-shirt and a jean and your sneakers, once you put this on, you would feel very classy or expensive. So just by the opening, I could smell right away grapefruit. It's like grapefruit in the air. I don't know, I don't get any other notes in here but the grapefruit berry. My favorite ever grapefruit scent in all fragrances that um, I have smelled, although this is kind of like a bit more like a daisy, Mike Jacobs daisy as well, or any other fragrances with grapefruit in it. It's a little bit like a yellow diamond, but there is something different in this one. Um, I think the Mike Jacobs one is more like on a green side, but this one is different. It has a very bright, um, bright, it's light, it's, some, it's something delightful as well, kind of airy. I don't know, I feel like I'll never go wrong on this one. Like whenever I cannot decide what to wear, I just wear this one on and I feel like everything's gonna be nice. <laughs> so on the dry down, this I got a little bit of muskiness in it, musky and powdery. I think it's the iris in there as well that adds the um, powdery scent in it. Actually, I don't really remember that much with the dry down. I care more on the opening. I just love the grapefruit, the quince, the citrus notes in here than the dry down but overall i think this is really a good fragrance so next is another fragrance that i love but i don't see a lot of people talking about this one this is versace's versen so this one i'm not sure if this has been um discontinued or what because i don't really see this one a lot in stores but i do love this one this one is another a bunch it has a bunch of citrus notes in there citruses bergamot it has um mandarin as well this one is citrusy and sweet so this one is another um classy expensive cell smelling fragrance very clean as well but i won't say it, it is not an out of shower or laundry kind of clean scent i would say this is um something different um i haven't really smelled this one in any other citrus fragrances the citrus that i'm getting here is more of the oranges or the mandarin 
Plus, what I like about it, it has that nutty um, hint in there as well in the background once you pass, especially when you pass on the um, opening. It has that cardamom as well, one of my favorite notes. This could be a unisex fragrance as well. Perhaps could be the cardamom because a lot of men's fragrance has cardamom notes, I noticed. But it is not like masculine because when you talk about a female or a feminine female fragrance and when you say um, um, unisex then you would think oh that could be masculine or something but no it's not masculine not feminine it's just unisex like if you can wear this one without smelling too feminine or you don't um, wear this or you can also smell like too masculine like it's just um in between i think either could um wear this one this one is citrusy yet formal i would say another like put together kind of scent as i mentioned more classy clean fragrance quite sophisticated as well a bit much sure but not much sure in a, in a bad way just sophisticated as this one i would say it has a youthful vibe in it but this one is fresh sophisticated um scent so it is very citrusy in the opening and then you will get that nutty vibe that gets sweeter um in the dry down but not sweet like overly sweet like a gourmand just enough so there's more in this perfume it is not just your regular um freshy or like clean smelling citrus scent and i would say even though it is a citrus scent i don't think i can wear this one in a very hot summer days maybe a cooler sunny day will do because there is something like rich or in this fragrance and the sweetness in there as well though it's not your vanilla kind of sweetness but i don't think um, it's something suitable for a very hot days this one has a quite um strong sillage as well and lasts longer on me so one thing that i do like in this perfume so next is a classic um citrus fragrance that we all know and this is dolce and gabbana's light blue so this one garners a lot of love and hate as well so this one i just had this one not so long time ago and i really enjoy um this fragrance i think the only thing that i can that i don't like about this one is it does not last long but the scent itself i really love the lemon in here it is really so fresh it's like a freshly squeezed lemon it reminds me of very cold lemonade this one is something i want to wear in a hot summer days so i like this one i don't find the citrus in here sharp or screechy at all as like the name itself light blue it's just light remind me of like summer days with a blue sky so wearing your comfortable clothes either chilling in your home or at the park so something like this i think like it's a very casual very chill fragrance so i think the green apple in here as well is kind of like softened the lemon in here that makes it not too sour or sharp smelling green apple gives it a bit of like a sweeter um, vibe in this fragrance as well that makes it kind of lighter although there are green apple that sours that is sour but this one is not gives it just enough um sweetness so the only thing is i feel like the perfume or this fragrance did not develop at all since it is um it disappears quite um shortly it does not last long that's the only thing that I don't like about this fragrance so what i notice after that nice um, citrus scent i get that kind of bland sweetness in it what i mean is just like a cold water and you add sugar in it that's it or um, like an apple juice that is that lacks of flavor so that's the kind of sweetness that i'm getting in here although the first time i wear this one i was kind of disappointed like what's the hype all about this i'm not really that impressed but the more I wear it, that's the more like I actually appreciate the scent. I just love, love the opening. I think it's just the opening. Like I don't mind spraying it again and again because I like that um, that scent, that feeling it's giving me. But after um, it's about to dry down or when it disappears, so that's the only thing that is um, not so nice about this fragrance. But other than that, I think it's worth um, trying. I think this is um, always one of be included in my list when it comes to best summer scents or citrus fragrances so last but not the least is um calvin klein ck into you for her so this one is also um um took me so long to appreciate this per perfume it's been in my collection for a long time and i didn't really pay attention to this one as much but when i was wearing this one um i do like the I, i've never had a citrus that um with a mix with vanilla this is like citrus and vanilla which is kind of like a 
odd um, combination but actually to me it turns out really well this is a very sweet lemon scent it's like not sweet like an overripe but like creamy creamy like a lemon tart to me especially during the dry down i do get the vanilla but i don't know because some people say um they don't get the vanilla in here but i do get the vanilla i love the creaminess in this one as well it's more like a lemon tart to me this is a nice cool summer night um summer night kind of fragrance i will choose to wear this one during the night at night time than during the day because to me it's too sweet for a daytime um use i really like it though the lemon here is like a very common lemon that you are going to smell like um car freshener <laughs> kind of lemon but for some reason i do like that maybe some people would say like a lemon um scent cleaner but i do like the lemon in here and plus the sweetness in here i really like it I do really get the vanilla. It's like lemon and vanilla. Just imagine that. You might think that's weird, but it's nice. And it's creamy. It is really creamy. It really is like a lemon tart. So I think the amber in here also adds that nice sweet, sweet um, creaminess. Because I love amber and vanilla combination. It has that in the dry down. So I think I will be wearing this one now since it's the last perfume that I will be talking about. Hmm. I actually got the sweetness right away not just in the dry down although it, say, it says for her it could be unisex as well but i feel like it leans towards more on the feminine side maybe because of the sweetness in here that depends if you're a man and you like sweet fragrances vanilla scent fragrances then you might like this one as well so that's it for my favorite citrus fragrance five citrus fragrances in my collection so thank you for watching and see you again on the next video